See, being stubborn is not a virtue. Being stubborn is not a virtue. The Bible calls stubbornness witchcraft. You know, say, I'm very stubborn. I know myself, I'm very stubborn. What you're saying is, I'm a witch. I know myself, I'm a witch. It's not a virtue. It's not a virtue. The Bible definition for stubbornness is witchcraft. You shouldn't be stubborn. You shouldn't be stubborn. You should be swift to hear and slow to speak. You should be somebody that can make adjustments. Because when you are stubborn, you manipulate every process to your advantage. See that? When you are stubborn, you manipulate. And when you manipulate processes, that's witchcraft. Because witchcraft is domination. Witchcraft is intimidation. Witchcraft is manipulation. When you are manipulative and intimidating and dominating, you are in witchcraft. See, witchcraft is not flying in the night. The most dangerous witchcraft is that young man with tie and suit who does not hear anything but uses everything to his advantage. That's the most dangerous one. The one with two open eyes and is bewitching people around. That's the most dangerous. The, the flying one is baby witches. If you, just, if you just carry water gone in the spirit and you twa, they die. Real witchcraft is the man that is with his open eye walking around eh? and using manipulating people by stubbornness to his advantage. That one is the most dangerous because you can't kill him. People are talking about witchcraft, spirit of witchcraft. Leave spirit. Witchcraft is a work of the flesh. You know, his spirit is a work of the flesh. In Galatians chapter 5, now the works of the flesh are manifest. Witchcraft. Witchcraft is, is a work of the flesh. Because it's manipulation. And stubborn people are the ones that have that tendency. They don't listen to anybody at all. They don't, I know myself, nobody can talk to me. When you hear a woman talk like that, nobody can talk to me. What I will do, I will do. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show that I'm, I'm a woman. I'm going to show you. That woman has been consumed by witchcraft. That man needs to pray seriously because what he is up against is willful witchcraft. Intentional, deliberate, calculated witchcraft. And you cannot break people's will. You cannot force people's will. People will only yield their will when they want to. So you can't even pray. You can only arrange circumstances and that will take time. When you hear people say, I'm stubborn. And you are trying to marry them. Tell them, what? Did you say, you're stubborn? I'm coming. I'm coming. I will soon come. Escape. Run for your life. Because what the person is telling is that I'm a witch. Even you, I will use you to my advantage. I don't care about you. I care about me. I know many people here that used to say I'm stubborn. We'll never say it again. Even right now, there are some people inside their mind that say I'm not stubborn. I know I'm not stubborn. <laughs> Am I teaching good? I said, am I teaching good? Yes. 